Hey everyone, I'm Steven21967 and we are in Stranded Deep. And you know what? I got lost out in the ocean the other night. I got far away from enough from my island that I could not figure out exactly how to get back to it. And I did. I did. I sailed all through the night and did finally find my island. But it got me to thinking, what can I do to prevent something like that? From happening again and I thought maybe what would be a good idea is in the future um, whatever island I go visit when I set up my my basic survival uh, camp you know when I set up the shelter set up the uh, water still and the campfire that I have all that facing the direction I last came from and that when I'm having trouble finding my way back all I do is I look at where I take the island I look at which direction my uh, my camp is set up facing and then I look from there and I see okay what's the island that's facing so the folk the plan is that when I start to zigzag too much and get really lost just face my camp toward the direction that I came from and then I can kind of zigzag my way back there. So that's what I think I'm going to do. I'm going to go over to that island and I'm just going to check to see if everything there is set up kind of the way I'm hoping it is. Yeah, we're going to go over there. If I'm correct in the way uh, my understanding of cartographer in the game is I had to go look into the game and then I had to go look at the name of the uh, is a hammerhead shark I had to look at the name of the island that I was starting on and it says southern bottomless atoll if I understand the, the way what was shown in the cartographer beyond this island right here should be the abandoned um, ship it should be that abandoned military battleship. It looks like a battleship. It could be, it could be, um, oh no, what's, what's, it's, it's not a battleship, but an aircraft carrier. Yeah, yeah, it's not a battleship. It's an aircraft carrier. That's, that's possibly what it actually is. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Yep, aircraft carrier is just beyond that. Alright, so I'm just going to go and kind of check my islands and see if everything is kind of set up the way I'm hoping that it's set up. They're all pointing, the islands I visited at least, let's see if they're uh, all pointing the different directions. They're, they're pointing toward whatever island I came from as a way of getting back, with the exception of the islands that are right by my main island. Because I can see visibly where I came from. I should be able to just, you know, point the uh, my camp right back toward where I came from. Okay, so I'm going to do some adventuring, get this stuff set up, and you know, we're almost there. We're almost there. We're almost there. Yeah. We're almost over there. Let's just take a look and see where was my camp set up over here. I think in the future we kind of have to do the same thing. Okay, I'm going to hit that. Yeah. Oh, we might miss it a little bit. I think I need to put more storage on my boat. Or my raft. My only problem with this is it's nearly impossible to see. I mean, it's ridiculously difficult to be able to see where I'm going in the very beginning. Here we go, whale shark. Hey, little buddy. Hey, little buddy. Ooh, just going right over that. Nice, we didn't hit anything. See you later, little buddy. And... Yeah. It kind of it kind of appears. You know, watch out here. I don't want to attract any anything to attack me that might have respawned on this island so 
Yeah, that's that's kind of pointing back toward our island. So I'm thinking about kind of doing that right now. Is I was off exploring over there and just got lost. And what I think I want to do is just kind of reset things up. I just thought I'd talk, just share that kind of with you. About how I think I'm going to handle not getting lost at sea. <laughs> For those of you who are, who are playing this game and are finding yourself lost. Man, I would just say every island you go to, when you set up a camp, totally um, make sure your camp, you know, my shelter right now, that's facing back to my island. And once I get so far away from my island that I can't see it, the plan will be to set up my shelter so it's facing the island uh, I last came from. Or it's pointing toward an island where I have a shelter in. So you see that island way over there? That shelter needs to be set up pointing towards this island. You know what? Let's go over there. Let's go over there and see how it's set up. Let's see if that one happens to be... Um, in good shape or not over there. You get this guy turned around. Don't hit the boat. Don't hit the boat. Don't hit the boat. You hit the boat. But it's okay. Ah, got to hit the rock. All right. Yep. Yeah, let's go. Let's go straight over there. Yeah, it's cool to see the whale shark, even though that's that's pretty small for a whale shark. Yeah, we'll worry about those islands later. There we go. There we go. There we go. We're heading. To, that looks pretty good. My guess is right now, at the size of my raft is, nothing is going to be able to knock me off of it unless it's like uh, one of the bosses that's in the game, like the Megalodon. Yeah, that might be the only thing that could actually knock me off my raft. There you are. You know, to me, when I look at that little guy, that's that's kind of like what I would say the size of a great white shark would be in this in this game in comparison to the others. Like, the great white shark should be considerably bigger than like the tiger shark. I do understand that ca that tigers can get pretty big. I mean, that tigers can be as big as like um, as big as close to as big as a great white shark. And let's see. What I'm going to put there. Alright, let's get ourselves turned just a little bit. Yep, you could still see home, actually. We'll see. Once we get there, we'll see if we can see our home or not. If we can't, then... Then we might want to... Um, what is that? Is that still our... Is that a great white shark? Oh, it's hard to tell, man. He doesn't get close enough that I can, like, put my my pointer over him and see what type of shark it is, which is kind of a bummer, because I would love to see if that's a great white. One of these days. One of these days, i got to go catch one. But I want to catch one nearby my, uh, my island so I can pull it ashore. That would be awesome. I think it would be awesome, man. I like great whites. Scarier than hell, but I like them anyway. Yeah, they're truly terrifying. I mean, any shark is terrifying. Oh, God. Oh, let's not hit that. Let's not hit that. Let's not hit that. Okay, so you see where that is over there? That's bad. That's absolutely awful. So, let's see. We came from there. And you can't see our island anymore. That's that's not our home. That's a different island. So, this one... Okay, let's see. All right, making sure. Am I in the shade? There we go. There we go. That's the shade. So, we can't see my island from here. So, what I need to do is I need to have my, um, 
my shelter needs to be over on this side of the island and it needs to face whatever it is that I need to use to get back home you know for direction so what I'm gonna do like it or not I'm gonna tear down my shelter I'm gonna tear down everything here and reset it up on this side of the beach so it's proper Let's see how am I doing um where is it all right good job Alright, so I wish there was... Okay, good. So there's water in there. Okay, that's an empty fire. Good. Everything we can leave the way it is. Got lots of rocks. You know what? I think I might just leave that one there. And... Yeah. That might make more sense. Why destroy it? Just leave it there. It'll give me extra water anytime I get into trouble. So maybe... Maybe we just make sure that the shelter is definitely pointing that direction. Right, that's the right one, right? Oh, you can actually kind of see my home, can't you? You can just barely see it there. Uh, let's see. Yeah. I think we can do this. I think we can just do that. And where's the fire? Uh, see, do I have extra sticks? Well, this island should have lots of sticks. Hmm. Okay, that might be enough. So, yep, there's home. And, oops, wrong thing. I don't have enough firewood. Thought I had enough for a fire. Oh, four. Okay. That's fine. Yep, there we go. Yeah, I wish this stuff were movable. It just it just simply isn't. I just can't I just can't move any of this stuff. So So we add this here. And we have this. We just drop that right there. Health everything's looking okay. And I know there was a coconut over here, so I'm just gonna just gonna eat this. Oops. Yep. Alright, hopefully this doesn't get me sick. We'll find out. There we go. Oh, we're all capped off and everything. All right, that's good. So, so yeah, I wish, I wish, I wish there was a way to move this. But as far as I know, there isn't. Okay, so that's good. We have the water over there. Can't really see it from here. I wonder... How are we doing for water? Yeah, we're okay for water. 
So I think maybe I'll just hang here tonight and then tomorrow we'll uh, head over to another island. Probably head over there. My guess is that that's too far away to be able to actually see um, to see my home island from here. You can just barely see it. And that's good enough. You know, that's good enough for right now. All right, so that's all it is I wanted to share. Um, just an idea for any of you who are getting into Stranded Deep. Uh, if you're going to go out and do island hopping, uh, set up your, your camp so your shelter and everything is pointing the direction home is. And I wouldn't rely on where the moon or the sun rise and or set <laughs> as necessarily being a good indication of where home is. All right, so that's it for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, hit the notification bell, get alerts when I come out with new videos, come out with new videos every single day. And of course, hit the, um, oh, oh, uh, yeah, of course, um, leave comments, I read them, and get back to you if it's relevant. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Later, dudes.